Because you're only like my best friends in the world. Okay, who do you think is the cutest boy in school? Ruby, you have to swear on your life to never, ever, ever tell anyone. But if I absolutely had to make a choice, I guess I would have to say... Cole. Cole? 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 <laughs> <laughs> Where did you guys come from? Ruby, I thought you were at home. How'd you IM me? Hey, I got Trollnet access from my spell phone. Don't you? Please don't be impressed with Ruby's new toy. Come on. Where? You'll see. Why are we at Obsidian Spell Shop? To celebrate that you got your glow. We know you can cast spells, but you need the right ones to cast. So we all chipped in. BFFL! I don't know what to say. I mean, Grandma says spells are a big responsibility. They're not just for fun. That's easy for her to say. She's already had her fun. Come on, move. <laughs> Beautiful. What does it do? Causes athlete's foot. Ick! But it's so pretty. Lesson number one. Never buy a prefab spell bead because it looks pretty. Some of the prettiest ones are the nastiest. Just like trolls. <sighs> Whatever. <laughs> this is so confusing. I don't have a clue what to pick. Listen, there are certain spells you just gotta have. Right, like an overslept late for school bedhead emergency spell. This one's my favorite. Many, many happy returns. It makes your friends forget they already bought you birthday presents. This one's so freaky. A can't see me spell makes you invisible to your teacher when you forget to do your homework. I never have to use those. Ooh, here's the crusher. Makes guys like you. But you gotta be careful. I once used it on a cute boy and crushed him flat. Ah, oh, looking for life's magic. Let me help you find it. Amethyst here just got her glow. Ah, oh, the sacred awakening. We'd like to get her a starter set of beads. Wise choice. Permit me to sense your aura. A girl with a gem just beginning to glow needs all the right spells for her magic to flow. I like the blue one. They're 
awesome. They're beautiful. They look great on you. This is my fave. Ooh, let me see. <laughs> Which one are you going to use first? Yeah, yeah, I one. don't know. I guess maybe... Back off. Give the girl some room. You know, that bracelet looks so sweet with her outfit. It's a total shame hmm? to use it up. Topaz, stay on task. Spells are made to be used. Now let's do it. Here you go. You can even use my spell phone. Just put the spell bead in the port, dial, say your spell, hit send, and when they answer, boom! Your spell is cast. You might be proud of your head of hair, but how would you feel if it wasn't there? Who'd you call? Jasper, I hope. Speak to me. What up? <laughs> you did say that these small spells wear off, right? Oh, I hope he's not too upset. The bomb. Hmm. That's what I'm talking about. Hmm. Hmm. See? And you were sweating it. All worried about the responsibility of using magic. Jasper digs his new look. Boy target number two, closing fast. Hole. Geek. Freak! Okay, okay, so he's a little nerdy, but I still think he's cute. A guy that kind of hot should at least be kind of cool. I don't think there's magic strong enough to help him. This one ought to do it! <laughs> Sorry, didn't see your table. It kind of jumped out at me. <laughs> Maybe we need to combine our magic and cast the spell together. You think? Mathematically, the odds are in our favor. Besides, what's the worst that could happen? I say we do it. Yes! Okay, guys, hands together. The spell is, though some may say he's just a fool, our spell will make that boyfriend cool. Say that. I'm so sorry, Cole. I knew we should have been more careful. Wow, that rocked! Can you believe how much power we have together? Whoa, ew! I can like see right through him. I'm so grossed out. I don't get it. It's too warm for him to stay frozen. <laughs> Uh-oh. What do we do? We gotta fix him. Would you chill? <gasps> hey! Get it? Chill? It's not funny, Ruby. Look, it's gonna wear off. All our spells do. And keep it down. We don't want anyone to notice him. Seth, stop pointing at him. I wish I could. I'm worried. The spell was, like, way bigger than it was supposed to be. She's right, Ruby. How many earthquakes have you felt during spell casting? Okay, I get the point. Maybe the spell store lady can help us out. She should know about this stuff. But we can't just leave them standing here. I got it.
This is perfect. Sorry, Beach Dude. Cuter Trollican coming through. <laughs> Come on, Seth. Quit goofing off. Uh, 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 whoa! Ow. Let's split up and get to work. What have you got, Topaz? Isn't this the yummiest? On task! On task! Oh, right. <laughs> Not his color anyway. Excuse me? Like, just what do you think you're doing? Um, boy shorts are so much more comfortable. Well, gotta run. Bye! Stop where you are. There's something funny going on here. Um, hi? What are you doing in there? I'm a student at the design school, and I just love your display. You're, like, so talented. Uh, thank you. We have to get back to Obsidian's and get help. <laughs> it's locked! Can we say deep? Doo doo. Hello! Excuse me, spell emergency! We really need your help! We gotta do something! We can't leave Cole frozen! Freaky. Whoa. Strange. Look! I don't remember a door back there. I bet it's the sales lady. Come on. Oh, now I'm creaked out. I'll second that. Ready? Let's go. I love the retro theme, but they could use a color consultant. Mm hmm. Good day. Ah! I am Obsidian. I have been waiting for you. Waiting for us? How did you know we were coming? I know many things. Then you know we need help. Why was our spell so powerful? You used the magic of the five. Huh? Whoa. Bizarre. Wait a sec. A, how did you know we cast it together? And number two, how did... Stop there, dear. You used ancient but powerful magic. Few discover it. So when we work together, we can cast kick-butt spells. Miss Obsidian, can you please tell Amethyst that the spell we put on Cole will wear off? Oh, yes. It will definitely wear off. Phew. So Cole will turn back to normal? Why, no. He will melt. <gasps> That'll ruin those it won't do coal much good either. Young ladies, do not panic. If you wish to reverse the spell and save your friend, follow me. The air is thick with the must of the ages. He just wears sneakers with no socks. What is this place? Why did you bring us here? The answers will come soon enough. Deep within the haunted woods lies the ancient world of the trolls. Oh, my. Wow. Look at that. It's so old-looking. 
Once this place was as alive as the great city from which you came. Then the dark magic arose and snuffed out the light of life. Look, lady, I don't know if you're trying to scare us or what, but would you please stop talking like our drama teacher? You are a tough one. You know it. Good, you will have to be. Now, follow me, quickly. I still don't get it. Why are we here? What do all these ruins have to do with us? You are here because your spell may have awakened the evil that brought this world to an end. And we thought we were in trouble just for turning Colin to a trollsicle. I can't believe it. I've only been doing spells for a couple of days, and I've brought on the end of the world. Do not despair, child. When this was the world of trolls, magic was everywhere. The battle with the dark power so scared your ancestors that they reduced magic to a plaything. Magic can still be a great force for good as well as evil. You and your friends have shown that together you can touch some of its deeper powers. Perhaps you may bring a new era of magic to the trolls. Perhaps this time they shall handle it better. Or worse. Yes, perhaps. But we must hurry if you want to try to repair what you have done. Bring it on! Follow me. Millennia ago, this oak grove was the most sacred place in the world of trolls. <sighs> now it's just ruining my hair! It was here that a true uniting of the five had its greatest effect. Uniting of the five? Is that what we did at the mall? Yes, and you must do it again in reverse to undo the spell. Sounds like fun! That is, if the fate of the world didn't depend on it and everything. Quickly, fit your gems into the altarpiece. It is the only way. Okay, here goes. Here's mine. Got mine. And mine. Mine too. This won't work. There are only four places. Obsidian, what do we do? Huh? She's gone! I can't believe she split and left us here alone! I wouldn't say alone. What do I do? Where do I put mine? Our gems! We left them there! Hey, look! <sighs> okay, that's weird. How do we get them back? Obsidian? Look! That strange door is gone. 
Maybe this was just a bad dream. You guys! Cole! Oh no! Look! He melted! What have we done? My grandma warned me to be careful using magic. What were you doing in that window? I don't know. <laughs> Ew! Ugh. And don't ever show your face in here again! Oh, oh okay, okay. Oh, I may need to go home and take a nap. <gasps> Whoa, troll babes. Hey, Cole. Hi, Cole. Hello. <laughs> uh, hi, guys. Hi, Amethyst. Hi. Hi. Cole, having a rough day? I have no idea. I'll bet you could use a nice cold smoothie. Uh, sure. Uh, could I maybe have hot chocolate instead? I've been feeling a little chilly. Hi all! Today I'll be casting a zit spell on Kaboom, the official troll test dummy. Say hi, Kaboom! Hey! First you need a zit spell bead, a spell phone with battery charged, and an incantation. Pools of oil and greasy pits. Cover this troll in a thousand zip. Yellow, it's your rare minute. Now that's a pizza face. Yeah!